Welcome to a short introduction to social technical systems in the basic level of module 5. My name is Thomas Lauda. Social te social technical systems refer to the interrelatedness of social and technical aspects of an organization or of the society as a whole. It is said that the social technical approach to an organization is about joint optimization. How may adjustments in the social relationships help to utilize the technical systems? And how may techn technical adjustments enhance the performance of well-being of a group? These are questions which are not only advise us in recruitment and in human resource management. Technical uh, does not have to refer to material technology. It could be to the structures and prevailing conceptions among a group or an organization or among the population in the society. Social technical insights are critical if you want to get the most out of new technology and systems. A common understanding of usability is the ease of use and learnability of a human-made project. A concept which is well known in the ICT era, which is often an important usability indicator also, is intuitive interfaces. When technology is developed, it is not only better, but often vital for the employment of the technology that the user interface enables persons to use the service, machine, device without needing help from external sources. This shows that social technical systems must be related to usability. There are four articles in this part of the basic level of Module 5. First, the two concepts we have mentioned here are introduced in two Wikipedia articles on social technical systems and on usability. There are two additional texts in this issue area in Module 5. The third text is entitled The Social Technical Principles for System Design by Clegg. Where are the guiding principles for making sure that this, there is a fit between the systems we are designing and all the social technical factors present in an organization or in the society? Clegg distinguishes between meta principles, content principles, and process principles. One of the most difficult tasks here is practical interpretation and implementation. The fourth article is entitled What does usability mean? Looking beyond ease of use. Usability is linked to user-centered design in a concrete and practical setting. It is claimed that usability evaluations should consider efficiency effectiveness, engagement, error tolerancy, and ease of use, or ease of learning. This text will help you to understand how possible social and technical interactions can be analyzed ahead of the implementa implementation of a new technical system or network, or a new device. Good luck!